Hey guys, Seethercourt here, and welcome to my newest video for today. We are now officially one week away from the inevitable implementation of the new COPPA laws for YouTube. And I gotta be honest with all of you watching right now, I don't know how this will play out. I could just easily say to y'all that, oh, I only got 7,500 subscribers, they won't go after me. But the reality is that I don't know whether or not I'll be taken out. So I'm not absolutely sure if whether or not this will be the end of me on this website. And again, if it is, please go and follow and check me out on Daily Motion to keep up with my content if it gets deleted here. And also follow me on my Twitter for updates. But if this really is the end, then I really want to make a video kind of giving one last final advice before I'll be like Spongebob and say, I, I'ma head out. <laughs> so with that, Let's really get into the what my last word of advice is. For starters, I want you guys to know that I think that our world is changing. I'm not going to go into exact detail as to why that is, but it definitely is changing in my personal opinion. And again, to give my own personal unique thought on this, I don't see it changing for the better. Now I could be wrong, I'm not intending to kind of scare you guys with this information. And I also want to make clear, I don't think like it's going to be the end of the world or something, or oh, like human civilization is going to be falling, or oh, the world's going to become evil. No, that's, that's not the case. I just think that there's just going to be a lot more problems coming in the future that I have a sense of. And to also get a little more depressing for a second, if I had to be blunt, we live in a really messed up world. Around 1 in 9 people in the world are starving, majority of those people are coming from Africa and South Asia, there's still many wars going on in the world that are killing tons of people, ISIS is still a threat, sex trafficking is very predominant around the world, increasing growth in technology is threatening a lot of people's jobs and could definitely shake up the world economy. But the list just goes on and on and on. You really start to become aware of this once you start reading the news more and looking more into outside sources. But the major problem with this is that at least in the area where I live in, nobody really seems to care slash doesn't even know about all this bad stuff going on. And I know that a lot of you guys come to YouTube and watch my videos for an escape from the busy and crazy and stressful lives that you have to deal with. And you don't want to come on YouTube and listen to DSP Gaming talk about how shitty his life is and then watch him jerk it on stream. I am sorry for putting that image in your head, I did not even want to picture that again. <laughs> But I get what you're saying, guys. You don't want to watch videos to feel bad. A lot of people come onto YouTube to escape their stressful lives and want to watch stuff that'll make them happy, and I hope to do that for the most part. But I feel like there's just some times where you gotta ditch that happiness and take in the reality sometimes. Not take in the reality all the time because that'll just make your head explode, but you know, just sometimes face some gritty reality. In my opinion, and I'm not trying to put myself on a pestle here, but there just seems to be this weird sense of I feel that something majorly bad is coming in the world, and I just don't see virtually anyone really sensing that either. Maybe I'm just weird or crazy, and if I am, then I'm sorry. But I just want you guys to know that even though I won't be able to interact with all of you or be that heavily invested into each one of you guys' personal lives because that would genuinely be impossible because I got at least a couple hundred of you guys who are actively watching each video that comes out and you guys message me and I can't constantly message everyone each and every day and keep up with every single person because that literally would be impossible. But just know that deep down in my heart, and I'm being absolutely genuine this i know like a lot of youtubers go out and say like oh i love all you guys so much even though i've never met all you guys like i'm not going to be like that but like genuinely i want you guys to be okay i i do even if i don't know you personally i want your life to be okay and that's just coming from me genuinely i say the word genuinely too much i want all of you guys to succeed i want you guys to be happy and prosperous so with that if this is the end and if a lot of you guys won't be able to have access to my content anymore I guess that the most I would ask of you guys is of three things. They are 1. Keep yourself informed and self-aware. 2. Try to educate yourself in any way. Read books, watch movies, do anything that will give you knowledge on something. 3. Remember to care about people and make sure to not all the time only focus on yourself. Because if every single person on the planet didn't give a crap about anyone but themselves, we would be living in the absolutely most horrible world we could imagine. And we're not, because we have a lot of people in the world that care. And the last thing I would ask of you guys is just take care of yourselves. 
Like, you know, if you're not feeling good about something, if you're physically not feeling well, make sure to do some things to take care of yourself. Eat healthy, get enough exercise, detach yourself from the technology every once in a while to keep your mind clean and everything. Now that's pretty much all I really wanted to ask of you guys today. Again, I appreciate you all so much for getting my channel to where it is today. I could not have ever imagined out of the seven, eight years I've been making YouTube content that I would ever get to this size. Like again, uh, every other YouTube channel I've been working on before this one over the five year span, none of them ever got to 100 subscribers. And I've done 73 times that much. So thank you. And I hope that my content has been able to provide you guys with enough enjoyment and happiness to where I helped page you guys back in a sense. Just remember that even in times where everything is hopeless and that the whole world seems to be falling apart and it doesn't seem like anything is ever going to get any better, know that we all still have each other at the end of the day. And I believe that that can get us through any obstacle that we face together. So that pretty much wraps up this video for today. How do you guys feel about my overall like kind of last message if this is the end of me on YouTube? I hope it's not. If it is, please just take what I did and please just apply it to your life in some way, shape or form, please. Do you guys fully agree with me? Do you guys think I'm being preachy? Let me know down in the comment section down below. Remember to definitely check out my daily motion page and follow me there just in case this whole YouTube thing collapses. And also make sure to check me out on Twitter for updates involving that if that happens. And also if you wanna keep the show going and helping me out if this does happen, please remember supporting me on Patreon as well. If you enjoy my content and wanna further help out my channel, please consider donating to me on Patreon even though I just said that. Also please consider donating to me on Coffee as well. Also, please consider smashing that like button, turn on the notification bell, and subscribing altogether. I've been Seed Through Cord, and I will see you guys in the next video. Remember again, guys, we can do it. We can make it through anything. Goodbye, everyone.